been cool eating my cereal and had her own oatmeal. Today I'm 41 weeks and scheduled for an induction tomorrow. So. What's it on? Yes. Mm. yes. You ain't tell me good morning. Oh, I forgot. Good morning. Good job, too. I always squat down to pick her up. Yes, sir. So you won't hurt your back. You ready for the new baby? I'm super ready. I want a whole new tour. Uh, come on, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I can go with one baby for one day. 41 weeks. Be 41 weeks. Oh, my God, honey. Take it back. Let's go ahead with these mushrooms. Go put it back. What's she doing so much wrong? Look at my sexy king. He's so sexy. I love that man. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Go take it back. Go put it back. So I can put some oil on your hair. Go. This is how we keep her from going up the steps, y'all. She terrified of this thing. So we sit it right here. <laughs> and she don't go up. It's hilarious. We invested all that money in them gates. Put it back. Put the mushrooms in the box. Come here. Put it in there. Now leave it alone. Haley, hurry up eat that cereal. It's already soggy. Come on, Orbit, so I can moisturize your hair. You boo boo? Did you boo boo? Come here then. Yeah, I hear her talking to me. She was trying to get smart. Tell my boo boo. No, I didn't boo boo. Come here. Let's get pretty. Come on. Ooh. Yeah, look. We put oil in your hair. Look at the camera. Say, hey. Look. Say, hey. Hey, pretty. Hey, pretty girl. Go. She crazy, y'all. Let me change her and moisturize her. I'll be back. So, uh, we just wait now. Daddy gotta go to court today. Some boo. -boo. Nah, these people, they want their traffic ticket money. So, we just gonna send the car away for him to come out because I don't feel like you can't go in there with nothing, no diaper bag, no nothing. Like, you gotta be empty handed walking in this car. I don't have time for that. So, we just gonna sit down in the car. It shouldn't be too long. It should be about 40 minutes at the most. Maybe an hour. Maybe not. Before we back up faking. Y'all, I'm still pregnant. 41 weeks. <laughs> really? Tomorrow they gonna induce me if I don't have a baby by tomorrow. 
alright y'all tonight I'm just preparing myself to get ready and go to the hospital tomorrow morning to get induced so I'm just all in my hair just got out the shower that's it really I got the kids together already and so it'll be next he gonna get in and he kind of getting the kitchen together so we won't have nothing to do you know coming home with new baby he washing everything the other night he got everything together he's so awesome so now we're just preparing ourselves getting ready and i'm excited i'm just I don't know. I'm nervous. I'm excited. I'm just overwhelmed. And I'm kind of hoping I go in labor like tonight. <laughs> or like early in the, when I wake up in the morning. My baby start doing his own thing. I'm going to do a couple of squats before I go to sleep. Because I kind of don't want to get induced. You know. But. I know after, I, at some point the baby has to come out. Like. It just can't sit in here. I just brush my teeth. Oh, and I don't use toothpaste. I make a paste with coconut oil and baking soda. Me and my kids been using that. Well, me and Haley. Daddy not ready to use it yet. He still use toothpaste. But me and Haley has been using that for like seven months maybe. Maybe a little longer. And I love it. When I say we don't have to worry about nothing, nothing, like, I feel like it get more of the plaque and stuff. It gets all between my gums and it gets all in between my teeth and, like, I don't have to worry about nothing. You see that all? I got to make sure it get all up in there because I'm being at hospital, pushing out this baby. And every mama know when you going labor, baby. Your hair dries up, your lip dries up, your face dries up, your skin just you be dry, honey, trying to push a baby out of your body. So I just want to make sure I'm really oiled up, and I'm gonna go oil my body in a minute and just let Daddy rub my feet. And really just get in the mood, you know, of having a baby. Just get my mind together. Do my little ritual. You know, that's my little thing. Like, I got to get my mind together. Get myself at ease. You know, everybody got their own way of doing stuff. That's just what I do. Get myself prepared. I got the girls food pack for granny house now i just did that tonight i packed them milk and uh pudding and oranges and stuff like that so they can have and they just snack raisins little stuff because i know granny granny 73 y'all she be still doing her thing though she still driving cooking everything but I just don't want it to be so overwhelming to where she got to be trying to find food. And, you know, I just want everything to be right there for her. So, I pop, I packed them a lot of little stuff. Like, she gonna, she cook every day. So, I know they're going to, you know, eat big meals. She always cooking cabbage and, you know, some kind of something. Yeah, I know. Had grannies on. You know, she always cooking, but... I just wanted to pack me a little so I could feel good and I could feel like I did what I was supposed to do as a mother. Because Granny and Amy, you know, they, they got the kid. And then Yanni there. Yanni just turned 14. Go niece. We turned up for her birthday. It was nice. But, yeah, I like to talk. And I hope my YouTube subscribers don't be like, or the people who watch my videos don't be like, all she do is talk. Like, 
I like to talk. I think when you talk about yourself and you talk about the things you got going on, people can better understand who you are. I want y'all to understand who Queen is. So make sure you like, subscribe, comment, share, whatever you got to do with my videos so people can know it's Queen. Look at my teeth, y'all. That's why I love oil pulling. You see how clean and get it? It get it good. Real good. I don't got no cavities. It just look dark in there. I don't, don't get it twisted. But I'm going to all date her tonight, too. Get him right. I had all Haley her, but I'm thinking now I might need to do Haley a little style. Because she's going to be with Granny for a few days. But she might not want me to. You know, Haley don't be trying to get no style. She like her dreads to hang. I mean, her locks. I'm sorry. She like her locks to hang down. Nothing dreadful about her. her. That's what she always tell me. Mama, no, mommy. It's locked, mama. My big girl's so smart. And I have to tell her, you right. Nothing dreadful about your hair. They are locks. My mother will be proud. Oily. My bad, y'all. Yeah. Put some olive oil in there for daddy. We just use we just use the bottle, but well, I use the oil too. Whatever this is, that oil was pretty cool, but normally we just use our olive oil on our hair. But that's me. Fresh out the tub. Got to shine all of my hair. I don't wax. I don't do none of that shit, y'all. I only shave for my labor, so I shaved and I shaved my underarms. Well, I didn't do it. <laughs> Mufasa did it, but I only did that for my labor because God created me with hair, and I feel like I need my hair. God put that on me for a reason, and you know it's my protection from whatever's out there. <laughs> but hopefully. This baby come on out, y'all. So let me get in here and do some squats and stuff. And I might come back and say goodnight. Look at daddy. Why you got to lie because I couldn't see you, baby. He's so sexy. Oh, my God. Stop it. You going to do tomorrow? You about to be a new papa again? See, real dark on this. I can't see. Can't nobody see you. He like it, y'all. He don't want y'all to see how sexy he is. Okay. <laughs> you ready, baby? I love you. I got this little big head self. I know this baby head gonna be swole. <laughs> yeah, he just got out the shower. I just ordered her. And we're gonna do some more squats. Well, I am. He ain't doing no damn squat. But he told me to let him know if I get still stuck. But I feel something going on down there, babe. So, you know, a little more than what I was feeling at first. But that's, that's Mufasa.